How's it going guys? It's our neighbor chat do your back and we're doing another one of these weird little uh, Charlie reaction things. I'm not gonna play the entire clip of Charlie because he's the one that informed me of this. To be honest, I don't give a shit about Twitch streamers. They are basically just people that stream their lives every day for eight hours like a normal job. And uh, I don't have the time to just sit around and watch an hour or two of streams and stuff. So yeah, that's <laughs> that's what that is. So apparently, Pokimane, which is this huge female streamer, uh, I do know her from uh, the only time I've seen her videos. I think it was because she played Among Us with PewDiePie. Yeah, I think that's the only time I actually watched or watched any of her videos and stuff like that. Well, not her videos, a video what that she was in and stuff. But you could already tell she's pretty fake in the way she talks. She, if, she, if she talks to people, it sounds pretty much condescending. It's like when you argue with her, I've seen clips when people argue with her and stuff. She starts to talk really slow to you like you're dumb and stuff like that. But that's not why we're here. We're here because she blatantly just went out and <laughs> literally called the people giving her money broke. Just because they don't want to buy her shitty off-brand fucking cookie thing that she made healthy cookie or whatever um because it's apparently like 27 dollars for like four of them that might be wrong i don't give a shit to do the fact check about that but it's like basically it comes down to like seven dollars a pack so in south african terms seven dollars is like uh, 140 rand now i don't know about you but i have never in my life paid 140 rand for a packet of cookies <laughs> and i will also never do that <laughs> I can pay maybe like 20 rand or 30 rand at one of the local like little shops and I can get really nice cookies for that price I think I don't know I might be wrong but it's like not it's definitely not 140 fucking rand so <laughs> it's crazy to me that they make the price that high when I think normal cookies should be maybe like one dollar two dollar you know not like seven dollars but yeah but this is special cookies because it's it helps you with your health because everyone knows that cookies are supposed to be super healthy for you especially ones that are made like that now i know you get all these healthy products for people that can't just eat normal healthy stuff because it doesn't taste nice to them but sorry to spoil it to you they're still not healthy they're just a healthier option than the one you bought you know like you get the normal version the version that let's let's compare it in fatness okay like if you eat the normal version let's say four packets you'll gain a shit ton of weight well not really but we're just it's just a comparison okay it's not this is not actual science it's just a comparison and then if you eat the healthier version of that four packets you just gain a little less than the fuck ton of weight you know it's they just like take out extra sugar maybe add <laughs> vitamin d like this what the sun gives you because we all know these cave bats that sit in their house 24 7 need that um so that's what you get but the clip that i'm going to show you is also i stole it from charlie i, I tried to find the clip but i just can't like couldn't be bothered man okay i tried for like two minutes and i was just like yeah, i'm gonna yoink this clip but this is the clip where she calls them broke and just listen to her. She actually laughs at the end, like giggles at her a little self, like, <laughs> that was so smart of me. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't know. I don't normally, uh, yeah, actually no, I don't, don't hope, I hope this doesn't like just fucking break her career because of course that will be horrible of me, but it will be not. <laughs> no, that's also going to sound horrible. <laughs> um, no, it would just be something like to laugh at if that happens and i know that sounds horrible but i mean people who change this much with money uh, and think they're above other people that gave them that money are scum in my opinion so i would laugh really hard if something like happened to a channel not like closed down forever no like just a few of the subs drop i would i would think that would be nice like maybe half of them <laughs> please <laughs> that would be fucking hilarious but um yeah this is the clip let's just listen to it and unpack the craziness that this bitch is spouting now <laughs> to buy seven dollar cookies is not smart so yes you might be broke you might be rich and still say i'm not for a book buying that that doesn't make you a broke boy it might makes you a smart boy because you're not going to simp just off of this woman that you're never going to obtain. There's like no way you're ever going to be able to date this woman. So stop simping for her. Like honestly, there's no way you're ever... 
There's people have standards, and if she thinks you're a broke boy, just because you can't buy a seven dollar packet of cookies, bro, she's gonna laugh at you on your first date. You can take her to like I don't know what's an overseas brand, Olive Garden, I, I think I don't know. If you take her somewhere like that, she's gonna laugh at you, brother. So let's move on from this delusion, you know. Just move on. We <laughs> we established that she thinks you're broke. All right. Let's just move on. Get some other nice streamer like that guy that carves on uh, on Twitch and doesn't want donations. Go watch him. Donate your money to him. He deserves it. She doesn't. She already has enough money. She doesn't need any more, dude. That's why she's beginning to show her true colors. Because she doesn't give a shit if you donate or not. Because she already has the money, you know. Maybe in the future, she'll care because all her money is going to go whoop. But uh, right now, she doesn't care. She's a millionaire, man. You're not going to like when are over with buying seven dollar cookies fucking hell just make the rich rich <laughs> but yeah and she doesn't retract by the way so i also scoured for this clip i don't find it but charlie said he also scoured and i believe charlie because charlie charlie's word is always right he always sends you on the right path <laughs> I don't know so i believe him when he says she didn't retract it later on and make a joke but just like <laughs> I don't, also don't know what the fuck she's reacting to. Look at that, she thinks she's so funny. If you want to play eight, pay eight dollars for Twitter Blue for some pictures, that's okay. I don't know what Twitter Blue is. I don't even use normal Twitter. No, I think Twitter Blue is maybe more like uncensored version of Twitter. Um, but if I'm not mistaken, it's not eight dollars each time you want to use it, right? Uh, it's maybe eight dollars a month. Uh, so if you want to use that as a comparison, how many times do these people normally eat cookies a month? Let's say once a week to be gracious, you know. So let's say they want to eat your cookies once, well, four times a month, four times a month. And your price is $7. Well, you're comparing it to Apple, or to fucking Twitter Blue, that's $8. So four divided by eight, or well, eight divided by four is $2. So you should, in theory, if you want to use that as like, a conversation starts or debating with that statement uh <laughs> make it two dollars then bitch <laughs> no i'm just kidding i can't call it that maybe she's gonna strike me <laughs> but like you can't use that something that is like eight dollars maybe a month or maybe a week not something that's eight dollars every time you fucking use it you know that's just crazy that she makes that statement and comparison you spend your money how you want I'll spend mine the thing also is it's your product you don't fucking spend money on it that's why you don't care about the price you probably get it for free and apparently it's also a ripoff of another brand uh that's out there i don't know the brand i'm south african i know bakers <laughs> they've got a lot of cookies that i like bakers is just like mm, cream de la cream if you ever come to south africa try bakers dude it's any one of them they've got the chocolate the chocolates they got the the other cookies, the digestive cookies, oh, the digestive cookies are like top notch. It's probably better than that piece of shit cookie that has all the wrong stuff in it. Um, just try, <laughs> this is not a baker's ad by the way, but it's actually good. If you come to South Africa, you have to try baker's, dude. Baker's products, I think it's called. I don't know. It's like this little wummy that's standing with a plate, I believe. I don't know. I've bought it. I haven't bought it in a while because I'm broke, like I said. But yeah, it's like this little wimmy or he's just a white figure standing there with thinking something in his hand maybe or something like that. I don't know. But it's probably going to be better than that. But she also copied someone. That's the beauty. Okay, I don't care enough. This, she's just going to sit there and giggle maybe. I don't remember what happened. But uh, like honestly, you know that... They decided to spend their money in a way that benefits you. So you must actually be grateful towards them because let's face it, with your charming personality, without them, you would be fucking working at a 7-Eleven somewhere. <laughs> that's, that's, that's mean. Um, with your personality, you'll probably, I don't know, secretary or someone in the job environment other people dislike. That would probably be you. Uh, since you are showing your true colors now, obviously, um, I don't mean to pick on a woman, of course, I'm sorry. Uh, this is just my opinion, of course, I have to state that it's my opinion. If you have your own opinion, that's great. Like she said, we all have our own. Or, well, you spend your money you, the way you do. I spend mine, uh, I don't get money, so I don't spend mine. But 
you do you, boo. No, I don't like saying that. You do you, just you do you. Uh, <laughs> just be, be grateful, man. Come back and do an apology video, like, go. All right, go to your management. You go to them, you say like, okay, I fucked up. I call them broke boys. So that means uh, less people are gonna buy a product. So let's compensate. How much does it cost to make the cookie? Oh, 50 cents, 50 cents a packet. Oh, because we only pour bullshit into it, okay? So let's down it and make only four, four dollars profit, man. Make it like four dollars or four fifty or five dollars. So we can make just a few do dollars profit off each packet. You know, just dial it down a bit. Uh, and then I'll go out there and I'll say, I'm really sorry about what I said it was a lapse of judgment. I uh, didn't know what I was saying. I wasn't thinking ahead. Um, I, w I didn't know how it was going to influence me making money in the future by saying this and I thought I was set but I want more money so I'm really sorry for doing that uh, please forgive me and buy my cookie I made it cheaper uh, that would probably work in your best favor if you did something like that and then you just move on with your life I guess but yeah that's me I'm, I'm not gonna ramble on about this shit any longer that was 11 minutes of basically making fun of her I'm not gonna do that any longer I'm gonna move on to the next video so if you guys end up enjoying my of course, my perspective of this whole situation of this dumb bitch and what she did. Okay, now I can't call her a bitch because she's probably really going to copy strike me. If you ever see this Pokemon, you probably won't because I'm a small South African YouTuber. Uh, but if you ever see this, uh, now I meant every fucking word I said. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy and hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers! Thank you.